Hey guys, it's Tanya, and welcome back to the Not So Berry Challenge. Uh, last part, we failed to get a promotion because, you know, I got distracted, but <laughs> we're gonna get it this time, and then we're gonna have an awesome weekend of pranking the town and just being a horrible, mischievous scientist, and I'm very excited about it. So let's go ahead and start off our day. She needs to go to the bathroom, get some food. I don't know where she's going because she needs to pee, um, but I guess we'll go downstairs then. Uh, we never use our upstairs bathroom. But let's go ahead and go over here and use the bathroom. Do not go on your computer yet. Uh, so you need to do that and then we need to watch you need to make some food and watch some tv i think we have some leftover pizza because didn't we or oh, there's a uh, spoiled pizza probably is this spoiled Ooh, it's 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 almost spoiled let's eat that quickly before it goes spoiled good 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 and then we can go ahead and watch tv while we're eating hopefully she's just like oh okay switch sides. good 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 getting her fun up just a little bit before work and then uh, she's working two hours so she starts at 10 and somebody commented saying that we can study our elements in our element collection to go ahead and get focused so we're gonna go ahead and do that right now Ooh, work in an hour okay let's let's study these hopefully this helps <laughs> I have a feeling we're not gonna have enough time but I'm trying oh yay we're focused yay perfect all right cool and they're gonna eat a little bit more pizza and then i guess we're gonna head off to work and today should go better than the other days i'm not gonna just grab all of the elements that are all around like it's last time uh we're gonna actually do our work so we're gonna go ahead and join her right now let's hop right into this invent the momentum conserver and brainstorm on the invention constructor so we're gonna brainstorm first i think um <laughs> i don't know it just seems like a good idea to me um but Maybe it's not. I don't know. We're, we're still learning. We're becoming uh, we have a little bit of an acquaintance bar rate up there with our invention constructor. So that's good. So we brainstormed. Let's go ahead and invent the momentum conserver. Uh, so let's cancel this brainstorm real quick. Uh, yeah, we're done brainstorming. Thank you. Uh, and then we need to practice analysis, get to know a coworker. We have a whole lot to do today. And hopefully we can get it all done by 7 o'clock and we don't have to stay late. But, you know, if we have to, we have to. I just really want the promotion before we go on to our weekend. Because uh, she has a lot to get done in this lifespan. Like, oh my goodness, she's going to be an adult in 15 days. And uh, that doesn't give us a ton of time to do everything that we want to. We're just going to have a collection of these over here. Uh, we need to mix up stuff. Okay, practice analysis. So let's go over here and do that. Uh, I know we're just kind of repeating all of the things we're doing at work each day. Maybe sometimes I'll cut the work days out, but for right now, <laughs> we want to keep them in because it's still new to me and I'm sure they're going to start adding some stuff that we haven't done before. So let's go ahead and uh, make synthetic food. Let's do that. Uh, mix a synthetic food serum. Go on over there and do that. Oh, who was that? Who are? Who? Uh, I can't pause. Oh, I thought it was Bella Goth. <laughs> it's Eva. Okay. Or Ava. Or I don't know how to pronounce anyone's names, but it's not Bella Goth. I got excited for a second, but you know, that's fine. Ooh, we are nice and focused. Things are going well. Like, we're in excellent, so hopefully, you know, maybe we'll get promoted today. Uh, if we don't, I'm going to be very disappointed and upset. Oh, we have a coffee cup here. I never even noticed that. Oh, oh boy. Huh. Oh, well, that's pretty. Uh, she successfully created a serum. That's good. All right, so we have to invent the sim rate again? Oh, boy. Okay, um, so we need metals and crystals. You know, I don't feel like digging for anything, so we're just going to go ahead and ask our crystal daddy over here for some crystals and metals, uh, and hopefully this time he'll give them to us. Hey, dude. Can I have some stuff, please? Okay. We got one alabaster, and we still need a metal, please. Oh, and our friend with the funky colored hair is here. He gave us a death metal? What? Where is that? I want to see it. Oh, that's cool. All right, so we're going to not use that. So I'll grab that afterwards. But let's go ahead and ask for another metal maybe because I want to keep that one. Or maybe we can't. So let's ask you for a metal. Uh, ask for a metal. Hey, can I have a metal, please? All right, cool. She gave, him a, gave us a romantium. So we're going to use that, and we're going to go ahead and invent our third sim ray. Oh, boy. Oh, it needs to be a common metal. So we still don't have a common metal. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so it wasn't going to take this one anyway because it's uncommon. Where do we get a common metal? We can only ask her for a crystal. Um, okay. Well, I guess we're going to have to dig something up, which is unfortunate. Uh, this should give us metals, right? Let's go ahead and dig this quickly because we have a lot to do um and she is hungry and tired and needs to shower and you know we're not there yet 
Uh, so quickly do that. Did you get a medal? Uh, she got a treasure map. Oh my goodness, this is ridiculous. Okay, you know what? We'll put that on hold for a minute. We're going to get to know a coworker and experiment on the chemistry lab. Uh, so let's go over here and talk to this person over here. Let's go ahead and get to know. Um, I also ask for a medal in the process. Um, but I just want to get to know you. Where is that? Get to know. Okay, so let's do that. And we're also going to ask for a medal. Come on over here. Let's do that. Hey there. Nice to, nice to meet you. Oh, she's materialistic. Good to know. And we have to experiment. We have to water a plant. Uh, let's get a snack here. Um, um, let's just get a pastry, I guess. Because we're pretty hungry. She needs to eat. Ooh, she's so smelly. Did she just not eat it? Did she put it back in the fridge? Or in her inventory? Did you put it? Eat some strawberries. Hey, Emily. We'd love to, you to have... You join party house. Do you want to go? No, thanks. I'm good. All right, so she's she's pretty high up there right now, but I still want to get more done. Uh, so let's see what we can do. She's hungry, tired, needs to shower, needs to have fun. So let's go down to that weird shower downstairs and take a shower in this in this thing, uh, and you know hope for the best. Uh, we gave her a strawberry that seemed to help a little bit here. Uh, so we need to water a plant as well. So we're gonna go upstairs and do that. Her day of work is going to be ending quite soon. But let's go ahead and water some plants before she leaves. Oh, I didn't want her to view that. That wasted time. Oh, no. Okay, okay, that's enough showering. Go, go, quick, quick. <laughs> We're on a time constraint here. Water that plant. Let's please get promoted. Please get promoted. Okay, she watered that. Um, I don't think we have time to do anything. Ooh, view a momentum. Ooh, we might have enough time to go over here and view it. Come on. No, don't, don't, don't water everything. No, we're not going to have enough time. No, no, no. Okay, she viewed it. Oh, perfect. End of shift. Promotion. Yay. <laughs> Emily did a fantastic job today. It won't be long before academic prestige and scientific achievements arrive. She's been promoted to junior tinkerer. She now makes an additional seven simoleons per hour for a grand total of 39 per hour. She's received the following bonus of 256 simoleons, a flying saucer table lamp, and new clothes. And her new shift starts Monday at 10 a.m. So we, when we got a vacation, day and brought home 375 simoleons so we are officially on the weekend we are level three in our career and we are well on our way one of our co-workers wants to know if we want to go out and celebrate and i think we're going to even though we're really tired it's just going to be a little bit of a mess because she's so exhausted but uh it's a good way to start off her first weekend after like a crazy week of starting the scientist career i want her to just relax a little bit take it easy have a good time but we're probably gonna pass out because um She's pretty tired, pretty hungry. Although we can get something to eat over here at the bar. Hello, you. Um, he's he's not too bad. We gotta keep our eyes open for some guys to help us make a little baby. That can be our little rose. So we're gonna go ahead and order you <laughs> a bowl of olives. No, thank you. Uh, let's go ahead and order French fries. That sounds pretty good. And uh, vegetarian safe. So many people are here. All right, so, uh, is this guy single, and how old is he? Oh, he's an adult. <laughs> That's a problem. Why can't you be, a, like, a young adult? Ooh, look at our french fries. Those look pretty good. Like, you don't need ketchup with those, though. Ugh, I'm so anti-ketchup on fries. <laughs> All right, are we eating? We're not eating. It's just there. Girl, I ordered you these fries so you would eat them. Eat your french fries. Please. Please. She's not eating them. Oh my goodness. Grab a serving. Please. Where are you? Oh, she went outside. Okay, there we go. Eat those. Is she eating them? Yeah, she is, finally. Okay, so she needs to go to the bathroom. Let's do that before... Oh, this isn't, like, the best outing, right? She's just going to the bathroom and eating french fries. Like, oh, goodness. Alright, cool. Uh, maybe we can socialize with some people here, though. Uh, get some little some people. So there's Dominic and Marcus. It doesn't tell us if Marcus is an adult or a young adult here, though. It just doesn't say, which is interesting. But um, I don't know. I want to, like, date somebody or get her to know somebody that, like, we don't normally see. Or, like, I don't recognize this guy that's the bartender. So that's kind of why I'm interested. Whereas I know who Marcus Flex is and I know who Dominic I don't know how to pronounce his last name. Fires, Fears is like I'm used to seeing these people, so I don't want her to be with them. But you know, you never know what will happen. Uh, we could be like, yeah, we're gonna be with Don Lothario, but uh, at the same time, I don't want to be. So <laughs> we'll see who she comes to like. Um, let's see. Has she met anyone of interest yet? 
No, really? Just this guy. And his name is Genji. Okay. Um, at least if we want to make a baby, because I kind of want to make a baby. <laughs> Not right now, but... Oh, I just realized she's at the bar wearing this outfit. That's probably bad. Ooh, who's this guy? I recognize him, but, like, not as much as the other guys. Uh, well, yeah, I guess I recognize him, Paolo. Um, let's go ahead and change our outfit into our everyday outfit. And then let's go talk to Paolo over here. And uh, give him a little bit of a friendly introduction. And we should probably be mischievous with people as well. We need to find who is going to be our second enemy. Who is our first one? Uh, oh, Katrina. <laughs> she's here. Oh, boy. Uh, she's right here. So that's fun. Oh, is she yelling at us? And we are inside of Marcus Flex. So uh, things are going quite well right now, I'd say. Because uh, that's what everyone wants, right? <laughs> uh, who's going to be our second enemy, though? Maybe, oh, we, we stick with the Caliente family and we, we can make Dina hate us as well. Ooh, I like this idea. Okay, so first let's go say hi to you because you're cute. And then we're going to go and, like, yell at her. Uh, rude introduction to Dina. Quickly. Oh, never mind. We're going to pass out instead. Sounds good. I'm going to have her introduce herself real quick to the people we want her to. And then we're going to have her leave and go home and go to sleep. All right. So we introduced ourselves to both Paolo and Dina. Good, good, good. Now she needs to get some rest so we can have an eventful day of being awful to the community tomorrow. We were on our way home, but then we ran into Maximilian right here. And he's got crazy colored hair that I quite like. And I'm thinking maybe this could be our new guy. Like he's just like walking behind us on the street which is a little bit creepy but we're like oh hey like your hair uh so they're gonna talk a little bit and then we're gonna head on home because i'm thinking maybe maximilian oh he's married never mind ah uh, okay can we break up a marriage though is that too bad i mean maybe maybe we can do it uh it might be worth it we'll see if it works <laughs> We might break up a marriage. Hopefully they don't have kids. If they have kids, I'm going to be really upset. But, you know, that's okay. We're going to go home, and we're going to sleep, and we'll figure it out tomorrow. It's a beautiful morning. We are up. We're making fruit salad, and we don't have the, like, we don't have to go to work today, which I'm really excited about. Uh, do we have any mail? Mm, yes, we do. And yesterday I picked up some new uh, stuff, which we probably already have in here. We already have psyllium. Do we have ozonate? Yes, we do. So we're going to go ahead and just get rid of those. Uh, do we have plathium? Is that what this one is? No. Is this it? No. I don't know if we have this one. We're going to try and just pop it in there. Oh, new one. Yay. <laughs> but we're going to get rid of these ones, and we're going to send some more off to the Geo Council as well after we cook up some fruit salad in here. Well, not really cook, but you know what I mean. She needs to eat some food, um, or she's not going to eat it. We're just going to get this. Oh, my goodness. The amount of things that just arrived in the mail. Okay. So we're going to figure out what we have here. I think we already have Fozone, uh, which is very here. Yep. And then this one is Maloc something. Okay. Celium we already have. Alcina, which is this one, right? Yep. Okay. Oxypin. Do we have that? Yes. And then this is, what is this? Vol something. Yeah, we have Volanton. Gubalek. I don't think we have Gubalek. Now we do. <laughs> oh, this is going pretty well. All right, and then this is Plathium, which we do have, and Kritaku? Rarity rare. I don't think we have Kritaku yet. And now we do. So we're only missing four elements, which is pretty crazy, considering this is the fourth part, and we only have four left. Because um, I don't think we needed any of these. I think we already had all of these. I'm just going to drag them just in case I missed something. You know, don't want to accidentally throw something out that we need. Uh, cause I don't know what the other ones are that we're missing, but can we like read this? Does it tell us? Um, ooh, okay, cool. Uh, let's go ahead and just sell these extra ones right quick. Uh, so that, uh, we don't get confused as to what we have and don't have, uh, when we continue working on it. So we're going to come over here and dig up a couple of rocks real quick and then send everything we ha have off to the Geo Council before we go out for the day to make some more enemies and get to know some more people. <laughs> you know, just want to make sure we have all this stuff done first. So we're going to go over here and dig. Can I not? Oh, there we go. Couldn't click on that one for a second. So we're going to come on over here. Hopefully we get some cool stuff. I already have a co couple cool things that I don't think we had. Oh, we got a capsule. I want to open those up. Uh, rain bores. I've never heard of that one. So that's cool. Uh, Fosanite, we already had that. But, you know, I'm going to send everything off like I always do. Because I prefer to do that. And Citrine, I've never heard of that. But who knows, maybe I've already had it. I'm not sure. And uh, Treasure Map, again. Because <laughs> all we want is Treasure Maps, right? So let's go ahead and just go into our lab right here. And 
send a bunch of this stuff off. So I want to see what some of it looks like. Felsenite, we already have. Romantium. Ooh, the citrine looks cool. Uh, rain boards looks cool. And yeah, so let's go ahead and send a bunch of this stuff off. Uh, send to Geo Council. Oh, what, what happens if we call about it though? Like, for example, I know we have Alabaster, so let's call them and see what they say. The symbol has been sent. Okay, well, I know that. I want to know what this phone call does though. Does it tell us what it, which element it is? A uh, small amount of Alcinat as well. Uh, okay. What what do we what about this one? Uh, call Geo Council about. Uh, oh, that's Romantium. I didn't want to do that. I wanted to call about Death Metal. I'm just gonna send it, right? Or no, we'll call. We'll call. All right, Romantium. Okay, that's fine. I want to call about the Death Metal though. Like, uh, okay. Well, whatever. We're gonna send everything all anyway, uh, just in case. Uh, like usual. Uh, send to Geo Council send to geo council and then lastly send to geo council all right cool and now we're gonna open up our little thing here and we got a new one we got Lindsay. uh where can we put Lindsay? i don't want to put her down there let's put her up here with all the other guys looking good excited <laughs> anyway let's go out on the town and see who we can mess with Nancy Lag grabs right outside her house, so why don't we go ahead and just be rude to her? You know, maybe this can be our next enemy. I know I was thinking of keeping it in the Caliente oh family, but we can do that as well. I'm sure we're going to <laughs> have to hate more people. So we're going to go ahead and lie about our career. And let's see. Ooh, we should uh, start for Prosterous Rumor. We want her to hate us, so we want to be really mean. Ooh, I kind of want to freeze her with a freeze ray. Maybe we'll do that afterwards. So let's insult her. And... Uh, mock her outfit. <laughs> this is fun. I'm like never just intentionally mean to Sims. Like, go up to them. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out with me. Talk to you later. I think not. Oh, is this? Oh, this is a different guy. A different funky haired guy. Elliot. But like, don't you look like exactly like that other guy we saw? Ooh, no, you don't. But you're cute too. And you're probably not taken. But you know, we're gonna say hi. But we're letting Nancy get away. Okay, we said hi. We can talk to him later. <laughs> That's enough. We need to go, like, uh, be very mean. We're going to go ahead and, pl and imply her mother is a llama. Ooh, the romance festival is in town. Maybe we'll have to hit that up and see if there's any luck for us there. We can invite some guys with us and see what happens and hope that it's good. I apologize if there's noise in the background. My cat just jumped up on my desk, and he is trying to sit down and sitting on piles of papers and making them crinkle because, uh, you know, he has great timing. Uh, Kira, oh, oh boy, this is the guy we met that I thought was cute. Her boyfriend is the guy, oh, her husband is the girl, or her, uh, oh my gosh, you understand. The other guy, Maximilian, his wife is the girl that asked us out to the bar last night for getting a promotion. We work with her. Ooh, okay, um, no. Ooh, all right, so let's just let's ignore that and we're gonna be mean oh that could be fun though like office drama like i, I start dating i should really get going now i should start dating like my co-worker's husband oh my god look at that face oh my god <laughs> i like this this is wonderful all right i want to get in a fight let's fight her uh yeah Ooh, we can already fight her perfect milestone complete yes all right um we're gonna fight her anyway. <laughs> then I'm gonna freeze her, probably. Uh, we need to get level three mischief skill. Abhorrent confrontation. Wonderful. Oh, that's great. I am so happy with that. All right, did we win? I don't know, but we're gonna freeze her because why not, right? <laughs> oh, oh. Well, this is great. <laughs> All right, cool. So we're going to leave Nancy out there uh, because we don't need her. And we're going to use the computer to cause mischief. How do we do that? So just a mystery, mischievous interaction here. Web. Um, I don't know how to do it. Let's see if it tells us. To increase mischief skill, click on a sim and select social from this mischief category or read the... Oh, that's not what I wanted. Uh, click on the computer and select a mischievous interaction. Sims can send chain letters, hack, and more. Ooh, okay. Um, I don't see those options, though. So, you know, that's fun. Because <laughs> I'm not really sure. 
Um, right? No. Household? No. I don't know where these interactions are. I'm probably just missing them. I tend to do things like that. Okay, uh, socialize. Ooh, troll the forums. There we go. Let's do that. That should be count as one of our using the computer to cause mischief. And we can just work through this. I don't want to stay home the whole day. I kind of wanted to go out, although the day's almost over, so maybe not. Uh, we did a good amount of stuff, though. How long does it take to troll the forums, though? Um, can she do any other fun stuff? Socialize? Mm -hmm. Web? Mm, nope. <laughs> I guess just troll the forums and we hope that works. Oh, it did work. Good. All right. And now she's going to apparently take a nap on the sofa. I should really get going now. <gasps> oh, Nancy Landgrab is like blue and just got unfrozen. I don't know where she is. She just left, but that's fine. <laughs> she had to stay outside her house in a block of eyes for quite some time. So I'm very happy with that. We're in bed taking a nap, but Kiera is calling us to go to singles night at the bar. So, um, I know she's married and I kind of want her husband. So I kind of want to know why she's going to singles night. Obviously she's like, oh, we got to find you someone, but she seems more interested in going for herself. So I'm thinking maybe she's not so happy in that relationship and maybe it's like super casual married. Like, <laughs> is that such a thing? I don't know, but maybe we can get with her husband. So we're going to go ahead and accept and we're going to go out with uh, Kara again and we're going to hope that we can get with her husband. We've been here for a little while and there is literally nobody of interest here. So we're just going to have a couple of drinks and then probably head on home. So that singles night was not very good, but we're going to have Emily head off to bed and we're going to have a fun day tomorrow. But I'm going to go ahead and end this part here and I'll see you guys next time for more of this crazy life that we have going on for her. Bye everybody. Please like, subscribe, all that good stuff. See you next time. Bye everybody.